In this session, I will demonstrate how the positive ed triggered D flip flop works. The first thing we will do is click on the board to energize the circuit. Now that we have energized the circuit, let's talk about the circuit's design and operation. In this particular design, three basic set reset NAND latches are used to implement the D flip flop. A bottom RS latch, a top RS latch, and the output RS latch which controls the output Q. If the D input signal is zero, when the clock signal changes from zero to one, then both the lower RS latch and the upper RS latch will reset. causing the output RS latch to reset so that the output Q is zero. If the D input signal is one, when the clock signal changes from zero to one, then both the lower RS latch and the upper RS latch will set. Causing the output RS latch to set so that the output Q is 1. What this means is that no change will happen to the output Q unless the clock signal is changing from 0 to 1. from 1 to 0, nothing happens to the output Q. But from 0 to 1, it changes to mimic the input D. Once more, from 1 to 0, nothing happens to the output Q. But from 0 to 1, it changes to, mi to mimic the input D. For more information on the operation and function of this circuit, visit TLab.com. Thank you for watching this session of TLab's tutorial.